starts spreading the news. I'm leaving today. I want to be a part of it. Wait. No. I don't want to have anything to do with that cesspool of a city or its ill-begotten son, D. Ramos. Ricky Santana, you think that by putting the embodiment of poor hygiene against me is going to affect me in any way? You think that by beating 30 other competitors in the extreme war and finally getting the shot that I've been talking about for a while, you think you can stand between that? You think I wouldn't have anything to do to say against that, Ricky? Now, I understand that the extreme war, you told me I had no right but to just put my title shot on the line. And you know what? That irked me. That got into me, Ricky. Because you can't do that. At the end of the day, you can't get at me because you have some personal vendetta against me, Ricky. What, because I'm better than you in every way? Because I've always looked better than you? Because your daughter talks about me all the time? <laughs> no, Ricky. It doesn't matter. At the end of the day, I'm going to show you, I'm going to show your boy Ramos, and I'm going to show every single person why. I am everything that I say I am. And if you think I'm going to let what you did slide, Ricky... I'm not only just a very smart man, I'm an opportunist as well. So I did some dirt digging. I did some research of my own. And come May 2nd, in one week, I have a surprise for you and for Ramos. I think that might be it. I'll be right back. Come on. Get out of my way. Get in the way of my interview. <laughs> you know, being your girlfriend's favorite wrestler and looking like this gives you his benefits. I finally got what I've been waiting for. One week. <laughs>